the cam is offset and it makes the the, the push rod rotate. Yep. But that's got nothing to do with the valve. Okay. So now you still got the valve on a stem with a rocker arm on it. Yep. And that's a little bit off center too. Okay. And that's off center will make the valve rotate. Got it. Because I guess slightly. Just a just a little so a little bit. So don't stick in that same spot. Yeah. Because we're talking about valves, we're talking about basically intakes and exhaust too. Mm -hmm. And we've always thought that that if you start a car up and go 50 miles, at 50 miles an hour, the valve turns red hot. Okay. And any little debris under that will stick that valve, and the air passes through that like a cutting torch and cut a hole right in the valve. So this keeps the valve clean. And mainly you find that on industrial motors only. Okay. That's industrial motor system runs pumping water or pumping something. Is it partly because they run a steady RPM? Yes, I, they, they do. Part I, of it. I don't okay. know what the RPMs is, probably around pumping water, maybe 3,500 RPMs. Right. Yeah, all day and all night. All day, all night, right. Yeah, yeah. Huh. But really, it's a good thing. It's an industrial motor, but not much on a race car. Right. Um, you have to be real careful because that, that, that rotary is, well, just sort of things, it's almost sometimes well, almost a quarter inch thick. Now you got valve spring problems. You just can't put it on a regular valve spring because that's way too much.